It was a dark and stormy night when we cleared the ghostly garden. MKDH here, and welcome back to the Pac Man World Reback 100%. Mm -hmm. No damage, no flutter jump, no pack dot attack run. And last time, we dealt with the ghostly garden where there was some death perception issues, as well as a couple of troublesome hills. But also a lot of. Mm -hmm. But, uh, but mountain and crash mm -hmm. Five mm -hmm. Platform fine passing, as well as high up enemies that was desirable to take out. And now it's time to move on to 6 2 to Pinky Catacombs episode. And yeah, back to We're done a little using alliteration for names. And we have to collect a key here, as well as the usual collection stuff. So, thankfully, this won't be as problematic. So, let's get going. And I see a gem here. I want to fight on a I mean, we did that in at the start of Super Mario RPG. So we're starting off with some enemies and then a hill. There's a cherry from the top of the hill. Oh. Here we go. Oh, there we go, we got the power pellet. Help fill, we can work our way down. Okay, that deal them. So now we can move on. We have a new move type, the walking grave. The walking grave operates similarly to the Womp in Super Mario 64. Except that the walking grave is significantly faster as we see. Of course, he's up against Pac Man, who's faster than Mario himself. Oh, we just have to bait these guys. So that we can bash on our. Bounce right off their backs. Checkpoint. And the letter P is above. Uh, yeah. Taking out the um, torch skeleton. Thankfully, depth perception won't be as much of a problem in this level. Troll skills. <clears throat> over here, over here, you spooks. The power pellets there after we hit the switch, but we want to first grab the ore for grabbing it. Back up. The good news is we haven't missed anything in case you're concerned about that. Yeah, because yeah, the A is here. You had to work. So the platform is above the abyss. There's also a slot coin that we can see is above the abyss with nothing nearby to land on. 
didn't get switched at the platform to start moving. Also, it also, it also had the statues start moving. I should note that the center one, with those three on the left, the, the one guarding the Galaxian, that would not move at all in the original Pac-Man world. It's all footage as much. I got like a boom. Oh, let's get to see it. Oh, get to Anyway, the point is, in the original version, there was a middle dot to allow for getting the Galaxian flagship without taking damage. Anyway, time for the maze. And so far, I've had trouble getting the handle. Lighting is bothersome. Low lighting is bothersome. At least I can say that the test is too tough. Oh. Yeah, I just didn't like that at all. Go back there, ghost thing. The thing. Here comes the ghost again. It's the lighting that's an issue. It's the I was worried about the depth perception there, but thankfully. Now we do have some crushers to worry about, but just to clarify, they won't kill us instantly. They manage to catch us, but still they will damage us. Which which is as good as if the killing is, it is considering this is supposed to be an old damage run. There's also some <coughs> thinking convenient with the flamethrower statue and his crusher. Which you can see is why I'm waiting for the Oh I am a fighter. Like the top of the rev roll. <sighs> okay, checkpoint. Yeah, who might think there's not. You might notice that there's Axel 4 
exploring in Baloa, but no, don't be fooled. You still die as if you build a new Abyss feature. I would not be surprised if Bill started evolving some magic. that red pearl sniping does in fact work on the, 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 the torch skeleton, but <coughs> I mean granted if it were awake you probably would want to put mounts in them anyway, but still. We have another checkpoint and still no sign of the sea. Well, oh, but we see the mm, mm, gifted door. Why you want to be aggressively uh, controlling the people? You need to go down this way. More pressures. It's not the fault of the level itself. This is the fault of Repack, because I 
looked at a video how the sea was handled in the original Pac-Man world, it was above the flames. I would not need an extra jump. I think the sea should have been shifted upwards so that so that it would align with the eyes. I would rather to see the uh, clearly needing a metal dot, which it does anyway, then uh, that the camouflage by the plane. What were you thinking, Repick? That's all the big problem. Could be, it could be speaking too early, but don't. I don't think so. I scouted the level. But don't think there's anything left to be a problem. The blue grapes might be an issue. Pete to collect the M. Where Obviously, I mean, they're up against butt, like, up against butt bouncing. And the ample feed left to, to, for us to grab the end. And what do you know? We're at the top end step, dude. Oh. Nah, I would have liked to have been an archer. But whatever, let's get out of here. Probably suck at the archery, but still, it, <coughs> I mean, a large army would still be it, still great for hitting stuff. Okay, that was close. That was clear. So, Creepy Catacombs was a nice little breeder from Ghostly Garden. Still a, a bit of bother with the hills. That perception was. But that. Things weren't so bad. My only real complaint was the sea. And that's. That's on the way 
repack anything. Not on the level of design, per se. I mean, re... Yeah, repack... Give it and repack... And take it. It did improve things without the Galactian Black Circus handle. Oh, and the maid. Yeah, flame traps were a little bothersome. Not the most polite, but... Uh, obtain the magic key? You can open all the doors and cages without using fruit or key. Uh, that's going to be a bit of a problem with this challenge. <laughs> that, yeah, in case you're wondering how we got the magic key, we cleared 765,000 points for, for global score. <coughs> Excuse me. So. It, and in case you're wondering why 765,000 specifically... Oh, Great Danger episode unlocked. Well, Nacko is you fond of using the number 7,650. Uh, apparently, uh, apparently some sort of wordplay on its name. That it, on the way it's in Japanese name is then... Japanese character naming is handled. Uh, uh, of course, it gets lost in translation, so if I didn't know better, I would have sworn it would have involved, uh, involved uh, some 30x multiplier. But, uh, the point is, 765,000 is, is 300 times, or, no, sorry, 100 times 7,650. Yeah. It, but we do have to worry about the magic key, but... Thankfully I scouted, and I can tell you... I can tell you then. We'll be able to use the magic key to avoid using the magic key! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, but... You might be wondering, how would that work? Well, you'll find out next time. But let, let me make sure that... Yeah, we can handle that. <laughs> Anyway, you'll find out next time we will be able to use the magic key to avoid using the magic key. So until then, thanks for watching, and I hope you have a good day. MKDH, out!